today I wanted to do a review on um, the Maybelline Great Lash Lots of Lashes. Okay, so I know a lot of you have heard about their um, Great Lash Great Lash before, and it had a lot of like really awesome reviews on like ma in magazines, TV shows, websites. But I know personally, I've read a lot of reviews on it, and people didn't seem as satisfied as like the magazines seemed to say people were. And so I decided that I'd give it a try. Oh, just so you guys know, I'm a busy agent. Is it a busy? Oh, no, I'm a busy agent. It's My bad. I'm a busy agent. I got this for free. Just want you guys to know. Um, but, I mean, this actually is a great product, and I would actually consider buying this on my own. Let's talk, give you guys some information about this first. The great Lash Lost to Lashes. Um, they call it America's most iconic mascara brand, uh, Maybelline, who is introducing a new innovative applicator brush, the Great Little Grepper. Do you want to show them? Sure. It's this. Um, it easily reaches the inner and outer corners of the eye, builds your lash look with no clumps, available in three washable shades, and it's available at mass retailers for $6.40. So $6.40 I think definitely is worth the price of what it gives you. And I'm just going to go into depth and explain why I think that. And these are in the colors. So we got black. it in very black. We actually got two, and um, we'll we're be giving this away, so you can click right here click right for the here giveaway. For the giveaway. Okay, the application tip. I think for mascara, that's the most important thing, the application tip. Not the formula, but the brush itself. And what it says about that is, to create your lush, full lash look, sweet brush from root to tip of lashes. Continue building volume by repeating until a stunning lash look is achieved. And no need to let mascara dry in between coats. At the end of the day, mascara removes easily with soap and water or makeup remover. So I haven't tried removing the mascara yet, but I will let you guys know in the blog post how that goes. And definitely removing the mascara is really important to me because my lashes tend to fall out easily. So that's why I use L'Oreal's... Um, what is, what is the L'Oreal thing called? Anyways, I use L'Oreal's mascara because it washes off really, really easily. And I hope this does the same. As you can see, I've already tried them on. I, I like it. What do you think, Lisa? I think it's actually pretty good. The thing is, is that like it, it definitely extends the length of your lashes. Um, but as far as volumizing goes, it, not so much. Not as much volumizing as, say, like CoverGirl's Lash Blast or anything. So um, if you're looking for volume... I wouldn't go for this, but definitely if you want to go for length, go for this. We got these in the color very black, and it definitely is very, very black. So if you're looking for a more natural look, um, I wouldn't go for natural black. I think it comes with blue and brown as well, so maybe like a brown color would be better. To give you guys an idea of how um, big the uh, applicator is, I'm going to compare it. I don't have any mascara with me right now because it's all in my dorm room, but um, I'm going to compare it to my Lancome Fatale. Give your lash in the Fatale. And as you can see, the Great Lash is definitely okay. smaller. I would say it's like the size of my th thumbnail. Size of your thumbnail maybe? Yeah, it's like the size of my thumbnail about. So it's very small, but I mean like that's great for doing little touch-ups in the corner of your eye and stuff. So the thing is that for these brushes, it's most ideal for this to be on the outside and this on the inside. But if you're using it on this side, it you have to like turn your arm around like this. So it's like kind of annoying to do that. Yeah. My sister knows what she's talking about. I, she was like trying to explain this to me. I was like, okay. <laughs> okay, so um, let's give it a rating. Four, uh, four out of five? I'd give it a four out of five. Yeah, four out It's five. not perfect in that the formula could be thicker so you get like more volumized lashes. But other than that, I think it's good, right? Yeah. Oh, oh, um, in terms of her holding a curl, because I did try it with a curler, it didn't really hold a curl, did it? No, no. I think it kind of did the opposite, but, but I mean, if you already have curly eyelashes, it doesn't matter, so. I think that, if anything, this is like a great enhancer. Like, I wouldn't say you should depend on this, but it is a great enhancer. Maybe use another mascara, um, with this, um, to enhance your lashes, 
even more. So I would use this like maybe after putting on my lash blast. helpful and let us know if you've tried this out or what you've heard about it and check out our blog post because we will be posting a lot of pictures and a lot of pictures a lot of pictures Lisa took a lot and finally be sure to click on this video for a giveaway all right thanks a lot bye everyone bye